I have a question for you. Do you love what you do for a living? When you get up in the morning, are you excited? Are you thrilled? Are you jacked? Are you ready to get going? Like, do you work late at night? Do you get up early in the morning excited about your next thing and what you're going to do? Or do you dread it? When Sunday night comes, do you say to yourself, oh my God, tomorrow's Monday. Or when Sunday night comes, you say, I can't wait to get back at it because I have so much to get done. I'm so excited about what I'm building for my future. There are two different ways to live. There are people that hate what they do for a living, and there's people that love what they do for a living. I'm sure there's people that are in between too. But a lot of people don't like what they do for a living. They're unhappy. They, they're in a job that's not fulfilling. They do it because they think they have to get a paycheck. They don't realize there's a better way to live. I've worked for myself since I was 19 years old, and I'm 53 years old right now. So I've worked for myself for my entire life. I had one job and I got fired by my own brother. But that was when I was 19 years old and I opened up my, my first company. And I can't say that I've loved what I've done in my business every single day, but generally speaking, I love what I do. The inspiration that you have, the motivation that you have when you love what you do, it doesn't feel like work. It literally feels like something that you love to do and you're out there doing it. Think about something you love to do. Like what is a hobby that you love to do? I don't know what it might be for you. Maybe it's roller skating or snowboarding or boating or snow skiing or playing basketball. What is your passion? What is something you love to do? Imagine if you can get paid to do that. I can tell you this, if you find a reason that drives you, you can learn to love what you do. What I tell all our students is this, when you find your why, when you find the reason that drives you to do what you do, you can really start to love what you do. Again, will you like it every day? No. If anybody tells you you're gonna love what you do every single day, you won't. Because sometimes, some days are up, some days are down. But generally speaking, you can love what you do if you know the outcome is worth it. And that's what I wanna talk about now is, is it worth it? When you're trading your time for dollars with somebody else, is it worth it? You're getting money to pay your bills. Wow, that's exciting. That's inspirational, right? No, not at all. I encourage you to find something in life that drives you, something that you want to do, and then learn how to get paid at that. And again, if it's real estate investing, that's what we have chosen, and a lot of our students have chosen. If you don't necessarily think you're gonna love real estate investing, but you actually might, it's pretty cool. But if you don't, you might want to use the reason why, like what am I doing it for? To get out of debt, to get myself retired early, to retire my spouse home, right? To build a better lifestyle, to live in a better home. Those things can drive you to love what you do when you know the outcome. If you know the outcome and it's worth it, right? If the outcome is worth the grind, you will learn to love the grind because you want to get to the outcome and you love the outcome. Does that make sense? So I encourage you as you're thinking about your goals and what you want to accomplish, how can you get there the fastest, right? Most of our goals have some financial component tied to it and it requires raising money, making money to reach that goal. Real estate investing is the one vehicle that can help everyday people create wealth because it's, it's simple and it's attainable for anybody, anybody. That's the kind of people that we are and that's the kind of people we work with all the time. So I encourage you, if you don't love what you do, Stop doing it. Find something you love to do. And if you don't have something you love to do, and if you, and if you do have something you love to do and it's not paying your bills, you're gonna have to find something else to pay your bills. In today's world, it is crazy right now how much things cost and the way things are going up, and it's only gonna add more and more stress to your life. I encourage you to investigate real estate investing for yourself because real estate investing is helping average people supplement their income alongside their current job, and actually, they love their part-time jobs more than their full-time jobs. And then you have some pretty cool choices to make, right? I can tell you that for me and my family, being able to give in the morning when we're through sleeping, do what we wanna do, be able to be there for our kids whenever they need us, or field trips, or whatever it might be, travel where we want to, do what we want to. Real estate has afforded us that kind of a lifestyle, and that's what I love to do. If you find that real estate is what you love to do, and you can find an awesome way to make a living at it, it's a game changer. Listen, we've only got one life. We have one life to live, that's it. Why not choose to do something you love so when you get up on on Monday morning, you're jacked. And when the, you know, Sunday night comes, you don't have Sunday night depression. You're like, oh, I have to go back to work. Now I'm like Sunday. Okay, I'm back at it. I'm excited. I'm thrilled. I'm jacked. I can't wait to do it. Think about which way you want to live because I will leave you with this. How we live our life is a choice. It's a choice. And if you choose to do what you love, you're going to enjoy that life and that ride a whole lot better.